Hi there, I'm here with Melinda outside the Santos office. Uh, she's participating in the protest here. So you've been out to some of these, you've met with families out in Camden, is that right? Yeah, yep. Um, with con with uh, concerns about what was happening in the gas fields near yes, their homes? Yes, And what was, what did you see there? Um, a lot of people with sick children. A lot of people living within 100 metres of gas wells um, had 20 wells within 2Ks of their home, um, children with their hair falling out, um, nosebleeds that actually spurt out and hit the wall like an artery, um, mothers that wake up to the sound of their children screaming in the middle of the night, mum, mum, and when they run into the bathroom they actually slip in the blood because there's blood everywhere and you know these children are children and why the hell should they have to grow up with this as their um, daily life? Like, if it's okay for people and children in gas fields to be treated this way, it's okay for everyone's children, and it's okay for your children, and it is not okay. It's not okay for children to have to go through this, and children when they're growing is when they're most susceptible. And you know, in 20 years time, when they're adults and they're you know, 25 years old and they start getting these cancers and things like that, mm -hmm. it's because of coal seam gas. So what do you say to Santos who says it's perfectly safe? It's not safe. That's just company corporate spin. Like anyone can say, oh, you know, it's safe, it's all a fallacy, um, it's speculation. But when you've been out there and you've spoken to these families and you've seen the results and you've heard these terrible stories about what they're going through, it's true. And it's, you know, this isn't okay. This isn't okay for children to have to go through this. Thanks so much for making a stand here. It's really okay. great. Thank you.